This math knowledge practice test question for the ASVAB and PICAT says, what is the product of the reciprocals of one and one third, one fourth and two? So product means we're gonna be multiplying all these reciprocals together. So the first thing we have to do is find the reciprocal of one and one third, one fourth and two respectively. Let's start with the easiest one first. To find the reciprocal of one fourth, you just exchange its numerator and denominator. So in other words, the reciprocal of one fourth is simply four over one. I'm gonna put a box around it to remind me that that is in fact the reciprocal that I'll eventually be multiplying with these other reciprocals. Uh, I could write two as a fraction by placing it over one. Again, to find its reciprocal, we're just gonna flip flop our numerator and denominator. So the reciprocal of two, which is the same thing as two over one is gonna be one over two. I'm gonna put a box around it so I remember that that is the reciprocal. To find the reciprocal of one and one third, we first have to express one and one third as an improper fraction. So we're gonna do one times three, which is three, plus one, which is gonna be four. So again, that's gonna be four over three. That is the improper fraction equivalent of one and one third. So now we gotta find the reciprocal of four thirds. Again, just exchange your numerator and denominator. The reciprocal of one and one third, which is the same thing as four thirds, is gonna be three fourths. Again, that's the reciprocal. So I'll put a box around it. What is the product of these reciprocals? That means you're just gonna multiply them all together. So we have three fourths times four over one times one over two. When you multiply fractions, you just multiply straight across. So in our numerator, we have three times four, which is 12 times one, which is 12. In our denominator, we have four times one, which is four times two, which is eight. This isn't an answer choice because this is an improper fraction that we're gonna convert back to a mixed number via some simple long division. Again, I could read this as 12 divided by eight. How many times does eight go into 12 without going over? That's gonna be one time. One times eight is eight. 12 minus eight is four. We have enough to write our mixed number. This one is going to be our whole number. This four is going to be the numerator of our fraction. This eight is going to be our denominator. Of course, this isn't an answer choice because we could reduce uh, four and eight by a common factor of four. Uh, four divided by four is one. Eight divided by four is two. So the product of the reciprocals of one and one third, one fourth, and two is clearly C one and one half.